Hey guys, Sanjui here. Uh, here today I have the uh, unboxing of the uh, Kotobukiya Fate Stay Night Saber Lily. Uh, before I forget, if you guys like my videos, please subscribe, like, even favorite, maybe share it. Uh, it'll help my channel out. I could do more reviews for you guys. So, yeah, we'll get into this then. Here is the box. You know what? I will move this for you guys. There you go. It's a pretty good looking box. Show off the side. There's some interchangeable faces. You know, like per usual, almost like an android. Um the sword and the sheath that's already pre-painted so uh, you don't have to do anything there there's the uh, sample photo of an unpainted kit so it's almost fully painted like this and the top here's the side with on sale is the uh, normal or I mean the uh, original saber in her blue armor or not really sure and all the you know what nuts and on the bottom nothing so let's get into this put this back down sorry there you go Okay, so we're gonna get a big tray of white for basically the skirt and I think all the clothes pieces underneath the armor. On this side, we get a tray of the armor pieces, the uh, gauntlet. On the back side, I think these are the white armor pieces for the skirt, but I'm not really sure. I think that's one of the back pieces. More armor pieces. more armor pieces. I think these are the arms I suppose or legs. I'm not really sure. I think these are some of these are for the uh, the legs, the boots I think right here. Here it is the bow plus I think a back skirt right here. And some, I think those are poly caps. Yeah. Some scary faces. Let's see. This is the smiling one. And this is the disconcerned look. And here's, I think, the neck joints. Alright. And on these yellows, I think, yeah, they're basically the hair. So you get all, like, the uh, front of the hair. You get the top. I think this is the bun. I'm not really sure. Here's the braid for it. There's a ponytail right there. Over, uh, right now, what I'm seeing, it's a pretty detailed little, little kit since it's a chibi kit. Here is... Oops, it's upside down. 
the uh, chest piece with the little emblem in the front of it, if you guys can see in there. The faces looking that way, looking that way, and facing forward. More of the, um, well, basically where the skin shows. I think it's for like parts of the uh, shoulders. Uh, I think that's it, part of the shoulders. Here's another joint. I'm not really sure. Maybe this might be the neck joint. So, and there's a little bit of a frame type deal right there. And here it is. The sheath comes in two pieces. Put them together. It's a sword. Pretty nice. Really detailed. And here is the. I don't know. Oh, yeah. There's the other side for the uh, sword since it's missing. There it is. So, I mean, it's just four pieces. Put them all together. You get the sh uh, sheath and sword. You get the manual, I'll get to this. And you get a little the deco sheet. You know, if you guys want to paint your kits and then put them back on. So water slide, so. Mm -hmm. Here's the manual. The uh, paint guide. The whole thing together looks really nice. Oh, here's a back shot. Sorry. As I can see, it's really articulated. Here's the inside. It talks about like the emblem, uh, the interchangeable faces and eyes. Water slide. How to put them on. And for the rest of it, it's just the guide. But I'll give you guys a look see. Looks like a simple kit overall. A couple pieces here and there for like, it's like probably like three or four pieces for legs and arms. But I mean, with all the trees, it looks like a pretty decent kit. So I give it a thumbs up. I'll probably do a review on this in the future, I'm not sure when, uh, I still have some um, family things to do, but I'm going to keep rolling out these uh, unboxings and reviews as soon as I can for you guys. Just remember, uh, please subscribe, like, share it, that'll help my channel out, okay? Thanks guys.